As we get closer to Christmas, you will no doubt see more and more traffic on the roads. Folks doing last minute shopping or hitting the highway to head out of town. And with that increased traffic also comes the need to up your defensive driving. Our Bill Churchwell spoke with Texas DPS on how to keep yourself safe during that holiday rush. Hey there, Bill. Hey, Leslie. Yeah, no matter how careful you think you are behind the wheel, the person in the car next to you might not be, which is why law enforcement officials say it's so important to stay vigilant, whether you are driving just five minutes from your house or five hours. Nina Esparza considers herself a safe driver, but as we inch closer to Christmas. He was speeding and obviously he had somewhere to go. She knows her chances of sharing the roadway with risky drivers goes up. And I had to use my horn and I don't like using my horn. <laughs> Road rage, speeders, distracted drivers. At 19 years old, she's already seen it all. Nina telling us her vehicle has been struck not once, not twice. Uh, third one, I was babysitting. But four times by record reckless drivers. I do think that it's not only on top of like holidays and them trying to get home or Christmas shopping or work even. It's just more of they're distracted on their phones or they're, they're doing other things besides driving. The countdown to the holiday causing traffic troubles, especially those known shopping areas from SPID to Everhart, Staples and McArdle. Here's a look from the driver's seat. That extra company on the road keeping us pretty attentive. We all have a million things on our mind right now, uh, but when we get behind the wheel, our, our number one focus needs to be driving to our destination safely. Rob Mallory with DPS says extra troopers will be out on the roads patrolling for speeders and drunk drivers. No matter what time of year it is when you go out to a, a fatality crash, uh, it's very hard to do because you're, you know, part of our job is to go tell uh, their families that their loved one is not coming home. And with more people traveling, there's always the risk of more crashes. We Someone met Sergeant well. Mallory here on what is now a blocked section of Twig Street after incidents of wrong way drivers in the area. Advise people to watch that speed, uh, wear their seat belts, and make sure you're getting plenty of rest before you leave for your destination. Uh, you know, over the Thanksgiving break, we saw several crashes where people were too tired to be driving. He advises, give yourself plenty of time to get to your destination. Check your tires and plan ahead. I know, I want you to get home safe. I want to get home safe, so the last thing I want to do is get in an accident. Bill Churchwell, 3 News to use your blinkers. They're there for a reason. So Bill, thanks for those great tips. And whether you are heading out of town